Your certified most accurate four zone weather with meteorologist Jeanette Kaye. Good morning. Coming up on 520 on this Wednesday morning, the chance for rain that's back today, but it won't be a complete washout. Sunny and warmer for your Thursday for Easter weekend. It's going to continue to warm up and we're in for a dry weekend. A cold front comes in next Tuesday and that's when we could see a little more rain in the area and by then temperatures will cool back down. Live look outside Raul B. Rodriguez Law Weather Camera sunrise at 729. Uh, no precipitation just yet, at least not in San Antonio, but that's going to change later this morning. 52 degrees and mostly cloudy north wind at three miles an hour. Relative humidity at 66%. Dew point temperature still on the low side at 41 degrees. It's a chilly start to the day, mainly from Hondo to San Antonio and points to the east and northeast. Notice lots of 40s there in the blue. The farther west you are, temperatures are closer to the mid 50s, 61 in Del Rio. There is some rain farther west starting to see some embedded thunderstorms as well. There's an upper level disturbance approaching from the west and that's helping to produce these uh, heavier showers and storms. So I want to point out that we're starting to see some sprinkles over far northern uh, Bayer County, but that's not creating any issues. That thunderstorm is now intensifying just to the northwest of La Prior. That's over northwestern Zavala County. That could produce some small hail. We're talking anywhere from pea sized hail to uh, dime sized hail. Uh, the rain uh, progresses east and I think we're going to see that rain closer to San Antonio between 10 this morning and 1 o'clock this afternoon. We are going to get a break uh, in the middle of the afternoon before another chance of rain uh, late this afternoon into the early evening. Across the country, there's rain that's moving towards the east coast. Snow over portions of uh, the western Great Lakes, but it looks like the heavy snow is finally moving out of Minnesota. So here's what to expect. It is going to be drying out along the border late this morning. Meanwhile, we'll see the rain along and east of I-35. Again, between 10 and 1 here, we'll see clouds give way to some sun after that, which will bump our high to the upper 60s and low 70s. Between 5 and 7 p.m., anywhere from northern Bear County to the hill country is, is where we have to watch for a thunderstorm that could produce a little bit of hail, but we're talking very small hail. Clear skies tonight, nice and sunny tomorrow, Friday, a few clouds, and then Saturday and Sunday. Uh, a lot warmer with some cloud cover potential hail size. And again, this is from this afternoon through the early evening, uh, anywhere from pea sized uh, to dime sized hail. Uh, the larger hail possible farther north into uh, central Texas. A few hundreds of an inch of rainfall today, possibly upwards of a tenth of an inch over in far northwest Bear County. But with the thunderstorm set up, that could uh, produce some heavier rain and more rainfall. Seven day forecast tomorrow, 77 near 80. Good Friday. Check out Easter weekend, 85 Easter Sunday. Monday, we're up to 88. When a cold front comes in next Tuesday, that's going to bring us a small rain chance and temperatures will be cooling down by next Tuesday and Wednesday. Here is the extended forecast for everybody else. That's a look at your forest zone weather. We will be right back.